Morning everyone, and no I am not at the lake this morning. Uh, when I took off from my shop it was still pretty much dark. Uh, I just left the dealership, dropping that 52 off. I pulled in there, started talking to him, service manager went out to the trailer, unloaded the mower and pulled it in. And I didn't have to do nothing there. They took care of or took care of it for me. So I talked to the owner there, got the list of everything that's broken with it or wrong with it, and they're gonna work on it. And I told them I have to pick it up Thursday morning because I have to have it Thursday. So uh, now I'm gonna go pick up Vicky and we're gonna go get started on our yard. And it's uh, it's gonna be a long day today because it's 38 degrees right now, and it just quit raining about two hours ago. So we're gonna go grab a couple yards, and it's gonna be slow going this morning. Just because the leaves are so wet, it's going to take forever to pick things up, but we cannot stop. We have to keep picking things up. So we're off to our first yard. It's warmed up to 41 degrees and the sun's shining. I'm not sure if it's going to shine all day or not. It's kind of looks like it probably won't, but hopefully it does. The breeze picked up again, as always, and uh, we're going to get, I don't know, how many yards we're going to get done today. Because the leaves are so wet, or if come up to a yard that's got a lot of leaves, we're not going to be able to do nothing with because they're so wet. We're not going to be able to pick them all up. So it's going to be kind of a hit and miss for the next rest of the season, I guess, because we're getting so much rain all the time. We're only going to have, I think, like three days this week where there's no rain. So when we get to this next yard here, I'm going to set the video camera up and we'll get a video there. Okay, this yard here, um, we come back to twice. Come back to twice, now we cut it once and then we come back again. So I guess we do it twice. So as you can see, it is a mess. And that all has to come down yet, which will be down in about two weeks. Oh yeah, it's a mess, and the leaves are coming down fast. So we're gonna set up and start blowing everything off.
shooting me with words, but I won't let them bruise. Even though it hurts, I won't show it to you. Cause it will ricochet, I won't let it bite. I will look at you and tell you that I'm alright, like a ricochet.
Okay, we just got done with our first yard, which took forever because the leaves are all wet and I blew the shocks off the DR again. So, and of course, I forgot to throw the, the new shocks in the trailer. So we had to go all the way home and then I couldn't pick the thing up. So we had to use the chain falls and dump them out in the middle of the garage. I didn't. And that's why we're called misfits. Because <laughs> <laughs> it does never go right. Nothing goes right. <laughs> but, you know, you get, you get mad, you yell and swear. That's why I wasn't having a video on because um, I, it was too much editing. Uh, and you put a tool in your pocket and you lose that. And... It's all out on our street. Vicki found that. That's uh, So you seen her walking around in the yard there. She was looking for the nut driver that I lost. <laughs> but she found it. Anyhow, so we're well, going to go. At least he, he tried to lose his head, but he didn't lose his head. At least it's still attached. Yeah, anyways. there's that part. Yeah. So. <laughs> Anyhow, um, I wait for so anyhow, we're going to go empty out the trailer right now because it's full and we got to go do one more customer and then I have to pull all that junk out of inside of my garage. So that's not going to be fun either. Yeah, it's going to smell real pretty when we get home. It's going to smell just like cedar. It's a mess. Yeah, it smells pretty though. Yeah, it burns your lungs. It's so strong. <laughs> yeah, all the cedar clippings in that yard there. But... Uh, yeah, it's uh, it's uh, been an interesting morning already, but this is what happens every year, beginning of the season, this time of the year in October, because of it raining so much, we find out all the bad parts real fast. At least the sun's shining. Yeah. Did you mention I blew a tire also? Yeah, he blew out the tire, yep. which, you know, he ordered the tire last week, or he got it last week, and... I guess he never put it on. I guess it would have helped. Well, that would have saved some time, maybe. No, I wouldn't have saved no time. Because it wasn't blown when we ordered it. But uh, since that is my spare tire, I'm going to order another one so I can have a spare. Got to have spare parts. So, got Block Air Company done at 1.30 on a Monday. Okay. That's well, about, they're not going to be hanging around all no, year anyways. No, it's about done for the season. So, anyhow... Um, we've got a lot of work to do shortly, but the leaves are still hanging on, so it's going to be a... It's usually about the week of November 5th, somewhere in there, right after Halloween. That's when the leaf season really starts picking up. That's yeah. when we get real busy. And then it will stay strong till about just before Thanksgiving, and then we pr probably be pretty much done by then. Hopefully. But we'll see. So we're gonna go empty out here and head on to the next yard. So we got all our yards done that needs to be done. We're going to empty out the trailer one more time. And then uh, I have to go home and suck all that stuff up out of my garage floor. It's on a tarp, but still that'll it's a mess. Fun times. Yeah, that'll be fun times, all right. So, oh. so Welcome to Monday. Yep. So it's gonna be a little bit of a drawn out process to suck all them leaves up because it's just a pain in the butt where they're at but I didn't have a choice and it's gonna take me a good half hour to fill that thing up suck all them leaves up and I also put my back out so I gotta struggle and walk around gently the rest of the afternoon and I don't have cannot get in the chiropractor till noon tomorrow which uh, I'm surprised I could get in that early it's usually getting in the chiropractor real fast is tough so anyhow, uh, that is going to be the end of our video for today. I thank you for watching and subscribing. If you check out the links in the description box below, it would be greatly appreciated. Have a good evening. Peace be with you. See you at the next yard. Goodbye.